Hi guys, it's Mrs. Millicent. Okay, we're gonna do the check your understandings for chapter five, probability. First one's on page 332. Okay, Pedro drives the same route to work on Monday through Friday. His route includes one traffic light, and according to the local traffic department, there's a 55% probability that the light will be red when Pedro reaches the light. Let's interpret this probability. Okay, so remember the definition of probability. Uh, definition of probability is that chance behavior is unpredictable in the short run and predictable in the long run, or, or it displays a pattern in the long run, okay? So, you know, out of 55, you know, roughly, roughly 50 to 60%. So in 10 lights, five or six of them aren't gonna be red, but if Pedro drives to work for many, many, many days, okay, many, many, many days, weeks and months, about 55% of those days, the light will be red. Okay, so probability is over the long run, not the short run. Okay, all right, probability is a measure of how likely an outcome is to occur. Uh, remember, probabilities are between zero and one. Uh, match one of the probabilities that follows with each statement. <clears throat> Be prepared to defend your answer. Okay, so zero means an event is not going to occur, one, probability of one means an event will occur. Okay, so 0.5 means half the time it will, half the time it won't. So these less than 0.5 are more likely that they won't occur, but this will occur, you know, more often than not, like 34, more often than you think, but 30%. This will occur every, every now and then. Okay, not impossible, but, you know, every now and then. 60% uh, probability, 0.6, means it'll occur more than half the time. Okay, because it's above 50% or 0.5. And 0.99 is practically at 1%, so this will occur a lot. Every now and then it won't occur. Okay, so let's see which, which one matches which. Okay, so the prob the outcome is impossible. It means it'll never occur, so that's zero. Okay, probability will never occur. Oops. Oh, sorry, guys. Uh, the outcome is certain. It'll occur on every single trial. Well, that's a probability of one. Okay, let's put percentages with these. Oops. That's 100%, oh my God, I can't even write. 100%, this is a 0%, okay? The outcome is very unlikely, but it will occur once in a while in a long sequence of trials, okay? So that's this one. It's probably not likely, but every now and then it will. It's got that uh, very slight chance. 0 0.001 is the probability, which is a 0.1%. So a pretty small percent, but not impossible. Okay, it will happen every now and then in a long, long series of um, sequence of trials. Okay, and then the last one. This will, outcome will occur more often than not. Okay, so more often than not, it's gotta be more often above 50%. This is occurring a lot, every now and then it won't. So I'm gonna say 0.6. So that's more often than not. Okay, so that's greater than 50%, um, but it's not all the time. Okay, like 0.99 would be. So that, of course, would be 60%. Okay. All right, last question. A husband and wife decide to have children until they have at least one child of each sex. The couple has had seven girls in a row. Their doctor assures them that they are much more likely to have a boy next. Explain why the doctor is wrong. Uh, if my doctor said this to me, I'd find another doctor. Because um, when, you, when you're about to have a baby, you have a 50-50 chance of having a boy or a girl. There's only two outcomes, right? Um, so 50% chance you're gonna have a girl, 50% chance you're gonna have a boy. Now, every birth that a, a, a person, a family has doesn't depend on previous births, okay? So every single time a ch uh, somebody's pregnant with a child, there's a 50% chance you're gonna have a boy and 50% chance you're gonna have a girl. So previous births do not impact the outcome of future births, okay? So even though this couple had seven girls, there's still a 50% chance their next child's gonna be a girl or a boy, okay? Nothing you can do about that, all right? So I would find another doctor if he said that to me. Okay, I hope this was helpful. I'll see you guys for the next one.